An author who's released a mock-up of Prince Harry's autobiography, Spare, has said the Duke is easy to mock. Relying on the Duke of Sussex being basically a bit stupid, spoof biography writer Bruno Vincent, 42, has blasted the Prince for not being particularly bright. The 42-year-old ripped into the recently published memoir and wrote up his own piece titled Spare Us, a Harridy. Completing several drafts of his mocking memoir after reading through the source material a hefty three times, Mr. Vincent presented his comedic book, which he said was based on a lot of meat found in the pages of Prince Harry's release. Speaking on the release of his cheeky biography, the 42-year-old, who's also taken on Enid Blyton's Famous Five, said he wanted to switch up a book filled with bile and hate. He described this book as an affectionate parody, rather than a merciless takedown, adding, A book that was just filled with bile and hate would be very unpleasant to write and very joyless to read. The author said the parody was more about making light of the royal than being cruel and said, I naturally gravitate towards just poking fun, which I think is pretty much the British national sport. He continued, The target for the book wasn't necessarily about Harry himself, it was just the whole project of the autobiography. I found it easy to mock. Mr Vincent noted a few bizarre aspects of the book, particularly that a Briton had written something so obviously targeted to a US audience noting how jarring it was for a UK reader. The frequent references to the US sitcom Friends were also a bit much, he said, as well as his habit of wandering off into philosophical rumblings. But the author did have some choice words to say about his impression of Harry's memoir and the royal himself. The aim of the book was to poke fun at Harry a little bit, but not in a cruel way, he said. It's just the book. Reading his book, I found it funny, and in some cases very silly, and it deserved to be poked fun at. Mr Vincent added that while he believes the Duke was in a difficult position and sympathised that it wasn't his fault that he was born into royalty, he added, it's not his fault that he's basically a bit stupid. It's not his fault. The author said he hopes his parody will appeal to both critics and fans of Prince Harry, whilst also providing readers with some entertainment, as he believes it's the funniest book that he's written. While he most enjoyed reading the first-hand accounts of conversations between the royal family behind closed doors, the favourite part of his book is a conversation between Harry and Meghan when they first started dating. The excerpt reads, I hear that you're in the hit US TV drama Suits, I said. It's a seemingly never-ending soap opera about tiresome privileged people bitching, manipulating and betraying each other for power, she replied. Let's not talk about my family, I said. Tell me about Suits. Meanwhile, Sarah Ferguson admitted on Thursdays this morning that her new novel could be set to knock Prince Harry's memoir off of the book charts. During a discussion about Harry and whether her novel, A Most Intriguing Lady, could potentially overtake him in the book charts, Sarah smiled. I think so, and Geoffrey Archer too. Take them out. But the most important thing is to stay positive. I think there's too much unkindness, social media as a sewer, and cyberbullying has got to go. Whenever I'm asked about Harry or anything else, I say, let's just look at kindness. And one of the Queen's messages was that there should be more kindness. And one of the Queen's messages was that there should be more kindness because it definitely diffuses malice. 